Hello guys, good morning. It's early morning, it's 6 a.m. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. For the old subscribers, thank you for tuning in. For the new subscribers, you are so much welcome and thank you for subscribing to this channel. Thank you for joining the family. So today we are going to do a morning routine. And uh, as you can see, I am in the kids' bedroom. I've just woken up my first daughter. And as always, when she wake up, wakes up immediately, she makes her bed. Uh, I always tell her to try and make her bed, even, even if she doesn't make it perfectly. But she should learn to always make her bed before going to school. So she has just woken up and she always prepares herself uh, without any help. So she will just go ahead and prepare. She showers during the night and sleeps fresh. So when she wake us, wakes up, she brushes her teeth and uh, cleans up uh, here and there then she puts on her uniform and goes straight to take breakfast she knows how to pack her snacks and uh, do everything for herself so my only duty is uh, to make sure that she wakes up earlier so that she cannot be late so I'm just, I'm just trying to keep these other little ones warm From the look of things, these little ones that I was uh, trying so hard to keep warm were not sleeping. They just had me leave the room and they decided to wake up and ask their sister for tea. So their sister was busy preparing and they were shouting uh, tea, tea, tea. Uh, so I decided to bring them tea so that they can go back to sleep in peace. At this point, she had finished her breakfast and was leaving, so I was giving her some uh, money because it was fun day in their school. Uh, we always give them snacks and uh, money for to pay in the school for some games. So I just gave her money and uh, she was leaving uh, the house as we were talking one, two, three. As she was going down the stairs, she remembered that she had forgotten to take her mask. So I was waiting for her to take her mask and leave so that I can lock the door and go back to bed. I was so tired because I came back uh, the previous day very late. And uh, that's why I just wanted to sleep more. It was around 6.30 and I, I couldn't start doing my house chores. I just went back to bed and woke up at around 9. Uh, these other little ones woke up at around 8.30 and their dad wasn't leaving for work today. So he, he came and 
as usual switch to the tv on uh, when immediately they wake up they come straight into the, our bedroom and request their dad to switch on the tv so that they can watch cartoons so we just switch on the tv and leave them to continue watching as they play in the living room uh, so this is what uh, the dad did and they just enjoyed playing without any disturbance so when i woke up i found them here playing and i had to start my cleaning organizing the sitting room uh, removing dust here and there and doing other small chores So guys, my house is always cleaned on a daily basis. Those who have kids will understand why. And the area that we live in, there is normally a lot of dust that you can't afford to leave the house a day without even uh, mopping. So uh, I always do this in the evenings or in the mornings. It depends with my day. So when I am supposed to leave the house early morning, I prefer cleaning it in the evening. That is not Tara cleaning. Tara cleaning has its special days. So we're just wiping the seats, uh, cleaning the carpet and uh, mopping on the areas that are not occupied with seats and carpets or with furniture. So uh, this day, I was uh, the previous day I, uh, I had told you I had come back late. And I was very tired. So, and this day I wasn't leaving. I hadn't decided to leave the house yet. So I preferred doing this cleaning in the morning. And uh, we always sleep very late because our our dad uh, or my hubby comes back from work at around 10.30 or 11. So by the time we go to bed, it's, it's always 1.00. And at times even 2 a.m. So uh, waking up early, it's not our thing. What we do is either of us decides to wake up our firstborn so that he, she can't be late for school. Then we just go back to bed. Then the other things can be done. So back to the kitchen, there are these utensils that are always in the sink when I wake up. Uh, these utensils are normally used after supper. So these days I wash them before bed at around 1 a.m. Um, those the, the utensils that we use for supper are cleaned by my daughter. So those that are used for tea and other stuff here and there, I clean them before bed, but when I am really tired, I leave them for cleaning in the morning. And also, among these utensils are uh, some cups that have been used in the morning. You saw my twins take tea uh, at six, and my daughter also takes tea before before going to school. So in this house, it's very rare to find uh, that there is no tea because all of us love tea. No one can go to bed without tea. And these twins take tea each and every time. I don't know why. They just love tea.
So after cleaning the utensils, I'm going to fetch water in my two sufurias. One sufuria is for uh, making tea and the other sufuria is for boiling water for my kids. They are going to take a, sh uh, a bath uh, in the morning. That's what they are used to. We normally take a bath in the morning in this house, all of us. Uh, so I'm going to put uh, to put it to warm as the tea continues and con and continue with mopping the floors. So here the twins are going to brush their teeth. I will help them. At times they do it by themselves, but of course uh, they don't do it perfectly. I'm just getting them to learn how to do things by themselves. So I'm helping them out to brush their teeth because I still have some things to do. So after brushing their teeth, I'm going to wash them. Then their, their dad is going to help me dress them up as as I make our bed, yes, after making our bed, I'll take a shower, then I will take breakfast. Normally, I'm not used to the early morning breakfast. I take my breakfast after finishing everything and showering. That's when I'm very comfortable. I know that I can take two, three cups of tea or uji or whatever I'm having that breakfast that day.
So after the kids are, are, are now have now taken a bath, uh, it is my duty to make sure that this bathroom is clean and dry. Uh, I always try to dry it, to make it dry because these twins enter this toilet every now and then. Uh, we always leave them to, after using the potty, they come and pour uh, the mess inside the toilet. So we they are not supposed to enter here because it's risky to enter the toilet when the floors are wet. So I always make sure that the tiles are very dry so that when they enter here, uh, they are they cannot slide and fall. So let's now make my bed and uh, shower. I'm changing my sheets and uh, putting the other dirty sheets for cleaning tomorrow is Saturday and they will be cleaned tomorrow with other few clothes that we have. Yes, I always do my cleaning on Thursday, my laundry on Thursdays, but yesterday uh, I was very, very busy. I spent the whole day outside dealing with clients and I did not manage to do the laundry. So uh, the laundry will be done on Saturday, that is tomorrow. So guys, I went, I locked myself in the bathroom to shower and uh, I got stuck in this door. When you bang it, it gets stuck and when, you're, uh, when your hands are wet uh, or slippery, it's very difficult to open it. So I was busy shouting uh, the kids to come and open for me. Uh, I was busy shouting. They were in the sitting room with their dad, but they could not hear me. But finally they came and they tried pushing the door and the door opened. Finally, I'm done with my daily morning chores and uh, it's now my time to have breakfast. Uh, the tea that I left to boil on the cooker, my hubby prepared it and uh, the, him and the kids have taken breakfast, so it's my turn to take breakfast. I'm now relaxed and I can take two, three or even five cups of tea. I'm going to take it with the uh, mandazis and the uh, toasted bread that uh, toasted bread that is toasted with with some um, brown. So I'm um, sharing with my kids. There is no time that uh, you will ever, I will ever eat in this house, and, and my kids will fail to come for some. They normally ask me, "Mom, what are you eating?" So I love them, and I love the way they eat. They are good feeders, and they never disturb. Even even as they take uh, cups and cups of tea, there is no time that you will give them food and they will fail to eat. 
even though uh, they have different uh, likes and dislikes one of them you'll find that she loves these types of food while the brother doesn't love that type of food so much and vice versa but they always try to eat and even when you tell them eat it they will eat their food and finish it or the remainder will just be a little a little part of it so if you watched till this part thank you so much and please for those who are joining us for the first time please subscribe subscribe and let us reach 500 subscribers and let us we are almost to reaching 500 please let us reach 1000 subscribers thank you so much and may god bless my supporters comment down below like share leave a comment so that i can read uh, i enjoy reading your comments please um i thank you so much and please have a nice day a nice weekend where wherever you are watching from or what time you are, the time that you are watching from please for the time that you are watching please enjoy your day enjoy your evening enjoy your night thank you so much and may god bless you